Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it's time for the act you've all been waiting for. The wandering wonder who amazes audiences wherever he goes. Prepare yourselves for an experience like no other. Prepare yourselves for the great... Silvando! And gentlemen, please! There is no need to be afraid! The great Silvando will never endanger his adoring audience. After all, darlings, you are the ones who make this show so special! I love you all! Thank you! Thank you! <laughs> Quickly, we must talk while the people are distracted. And please, not a word of this to anyone. Now, as you may be aware, the Sun National is the most important event of the year here in Galopolis. And tomorrow, I am due to make my debut in the race to end all races. However, there is a problem. One teeny tiny terrible problem. I cannot ride. In fact, I have barely so much as sat in a saddle. What? I have so far been able to hide this uh, unfortunate fact, but if I were to take part in the race, the inconvenient truth would surely be uncovered. And yet I have no choice for a prince of Golopolis not to take part in the Sun National on the year of his coming of age is unthinkable! Unthinkable! Huh. Huh? So you see, your coming here was fated! It is a sign! The forces of destiny mean me to use you as my double! Ta-da! Your double? How's that gonna work? Won't everyone notice as soon as he walks out onto the track? Ah, the fates have provided that also! For you see, the royal family always races in full armor, lest the unthinkable occur. His face will be hidden from view! Oh, please, please! I beg of you, you must help me! You must enter the Sun National in my place! You are the most pathetic excuse for a prince I've ever seen. If you think we're going to help you lie to your people, you've got another thing coming. <laughs> is that so? Then I assume that your need of the rainbow is not so great after all. Wow. Talk about shameless. Call me what you will, it changes nothing. You will do as the fates wish and take my place in the race? 
<laughs> oh, a thousand pardons. I could not hear you over the noise of the crowd. Allow me to ask again. Will you enter the San National in my place? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I knew you would see sense in the end. Thank you. I will talk to my father about the rainbow as soon as the race is over. You have my word. I took the liberty of arranging rooms for you at the inn. Rest well. I will see you in the stables, bright and early. You will find the stable entrance in the western part of the city. Do not be late. Now, I must be on my way. Farewell, friends! <laughs> Politans. This is uh, no ordinary sand national. Uh. Hooray! All hail Prince Varys! Ha ha ha! 
fine figure of a man. It must be wonderful to be so popular, darling. But of course, you are used to it. Being a real live prince, huh? The name's Silvando, by the way. One of the other writers had a little whoopsie, so I had to step in at the last minute. But don't think I'll be going easy on you just because you're royalty. Where would be the fun in that? Try to keep up, little princey! You are most talented, a far more natural horseman than I... Now quickly, my public await! I shall take the reins from here. <laughs> Fear not, my friend. I have not forgotten my promise. I will discuss the rainbow with my father, just as soon as my people have finished showering me with adulation!
Praise the fates. Our plan was a su- Thank you. You have spared me great humiliation. <laughs> I will go immediately to my father and ask about the rainbow. <gasps> All hail, Prince Faris! Pride of the desert. Horseman extraordinaire! Darling, you are fabulous. It was... Uh, 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 oh. Wait, don't tell me you were... <gasps> Surely you didn't let your understudy take the stage for the command performance? <gasps> oh, this is too, too good! Wait, wait! But you do not understand the pressure I am under! A prince of Galopolis who could not ride a horse is a disgrace to the kingdom! I did what was necessary for the sake of my people! And now, all can be forgotten. Yes? And there was silly old Silvando thinking that knights never retreated in the face of adversity! Silence! I am the prince of this kingdom, and I will not have a traveling jester lecture me on chivalry! <gasps> a thousand pardons, your highness! <gasps> Enter! The Sultan wishes to see you, Your Highness. Your magnificent display of horsemanship has pleased him greatly. Very good. I will come right away. My promise still stands. Come to the throne room in a little while. We will see what can be done about this branch of yours. So nice to see a royal with the common touch. You were wonderful out there today, darling. Maybe we'll get to share the stage again soon. <laughs> Thank you.
I am humbled. All I have ever desired is to fulfill my duties as a prince and as a knight. Father, if I may, I have promised to assist these travelers. Would you permit me to explain? Gladly, my son. It warms my heart to see you aiding those in need. Truly, you have taken the Knight's Pledge to heart. Thank you, Father. <laughs> the truth of the matter is that my friends here have come to Galopolis in search of the rain. <sighs> Your Majesty! The beast has returned! It attacked one of our men while we were out on patrol. The Slayer of the Sands is back? Why must the accursed creature always appear on this, the happiest day of the year? We will stand for this no longer! I must dispatch my finest knights and ensure that the fiend never again returns to terrorize the Celestial Sand. But wait! My boy! The fates are speaking to us! Capturing the Slayer would be the perfect way to show your people what a fine knight you have become! What? But, 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 but oh, father! <laughs> so many of our bravest men have confronted the creature and... perished! <laughs> Surely, <laughs> I do not stand a chance! <laughs> Truly, it is the most able who are the most humble. But you cannot hide your true feelings. You are trembling with excitement. This is your moment, Faris, my boy. Capture the Slayer and take your place in history. But uh, I... I... Oh, very, very well, father. <laughs> Yay! I shall begin my preparations right away. Oh, 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 a thousand pardons. The, the rainbow will have to wait. Meet me in my chambers. There is something we must discuss. Oh, 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 just breathe, Faris. I beg of you, the Slayer of the Sands will tear me limb from limb unless you aid me. Have pity on a desperate soul! Spoken like a true desert knight. Seriously, can't you handle this on your own? No! No, such a thing is impossible! I am no knight! I neglected my training! I allowed my vassals to fight all oh, my battles for me! <laughs> oh, it is not my fault! I am an only child! I was coddled from birth and praised for the most insignificant of achievements! I did not wish to disappoint my parents or my people, so I, I, I found ways of, of seeming to fulfill their expectations without necessarily doing so. But the more I fulfilled them, the more their expectations grew, and now finally they expect the impossible. Ow, 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 it's so unfair. Don't you see? If you refuse to help me, I will be sent to my doom, and through no fault of my own. <laughs> Please, will you take pity on your old friend? <laughs> Do it for me! Do it for Galopolis! 
<laughs> oh, thank you. Ten thousand thank yous. <laughs> and fear not. I will speak to my father about the rainbow as soon as the beast is captured. We must make preparations to depart immediately. I will await you at the castle gates. What a pathetic excuse for a prince. Goodness knows what'll become of Galopolis with him in charge. Oh, we mustn't be so hard on him, Veronica. I'm sure it can't be easy growing up with everyone expecting so much of you.